As a painter, you want to just plant yourself in the perfect spot. Ideally, it's best to start and finish a plein air painting in one session, which may be an hour, two hours, three hours, depending on the complexity of the scene and how you're responding to the, to the image. Well, the William A. Irvin is kind of overlooked by residents. They kind of take it for granted. I mean, it's really this incredible floating museum, and it's quite a historic ship. And so it's something that I've been wanting to paint for a long time to kind of remind people what a special place it is. I really had only about an hour and a half of light in terms of how it was hitting the side of the hull of the Irvin. And once that light was gone, it was really pretty much over. I either come back another day or work from memory. I'll choose to come back another day and hope for a similar light. Well, I'm working on a solo exhibition of plein air oil paintings, and the theme for my show is Start Seeing Duluth, and it's literally paintings throughout Duluth. So in Glensheen is certainly iconic and it's absolutely beautiful here. The gardens, the, the building itself, inside, outside, it's just really a wonderful place to be. The sun is very important for this painting because this is a light and shadow painting. Well, my approach right now is what's called a la prima. I'm trying to finish certain parts of the painting uh, because my light is changing so rapidly. When the sun comes back, then I'll probably go back into the light areas and begin capturing those color notes. There are many ways to begin a painting, and the scene really tells you the best way to begin that painting. In this particular instance, it was very important to me to get the architecture of the scene correct. You know, I'm not going to, you know, paint every little terracotta brick, you know, or any of those kinds of things. It's about how the light hits those objects, and that's what I'm responding to as a viewer. And when I painted this, I just simply thought about the Congdon family just enjoying this porch every summer. So I really enjoyed setting up for a couple of days. For me as a painter, I will continue painting in Duluth for many, many years to come. And I'm very excited about where that will take me throughout the city.